What's going on, YouTube? Master Luke 5 coming at you live from the PlayStation Network. I was debating whether or not I should make this video because essentially what tends to happen with YouTube and videos and just the whole community in general is that somebody makes a video about something that somebody knows and it's been either a secret for a long time and then all of a sudden it gets on YouTube and then the developers have the potential to patch it and fix it, right? Whether this is intended or not, I don't know. I, I doubt that it's intended, but let's just talk about the content of the video. So, for the longest time... Dark Zone players, for example, were able to like go into the Dark Zone and then, you know, the DZ crates, you can steal the crate while your friend was opening it at the same time, which effectively meant you can open the crates twice uh, at the same time, right? And get double the loot, double the exotic components. That has been a secret for the longest time. And even though I knew about it and a lot of DZ players knew about it, nobody really posted it on YouTube. And then, all of a sudden, they posted it on YouTube and they fixed it after whatever amount of time, years, right? So I do know the repercussions of posting certain videos where they might patch it. But at the end of the day, I mean, I'm a DZ player and I know this trick and I don't think it'd be fair for me to just sit here and pretend like I don't know. Um, and it could probably help other players out especially those who are trying to farm specific targeted loot in the DZ if you're a level 40 character and you want to go into DZ to farm certain types of loot. If the developers decide to patch this, fine, patch it. But at the at the very least, I'm telling the community that this is this is a possibility. Like you can do this today right now. And it's not cheating or anything. I don't do cheats, but it's an it's a, it's an unintended exploit. Let's just say that, okay? <sighs> I'm posting this against my better judgment. I normally don't want to do things like this, but it is what it is. Let's just let's just tell the community and see where the the ball rolls, okay? So without further ado, here's here's what's happening. So today is uh, May fifth, right? The targeted loot in the DZ. For example, if you look at your mini map, if you log into the DZ US, the targeted loot in the West is going to be Douglas and Hardy, right? Well, check it out. I'm on my 40 character. Okay, this is my level 40 character. Shea level 7,222. When I go to my map, today is May 5th, targeted loot, ARs. Sokolov and Negotiator, okay? This is not the targeted loot for today, May 5th, for level 40 characters, okay? But it is for me. And I can go into the DZ right now and farm targeted loot. And I'll play a little clip of me doing that. But I'm not going to waste too much time. The way that this is achieved is... All you need to do, okay, all you need to do is get a level 30 character. Whether you have a level 30 character or your friend has a level 30 character. Let's say your friend has a level 30 character. Have your friend invite you into his session for level 30. And then go to the DZ. Because this targeted loot, this is what level 30 characters see today, May 5th. The targeted loot for level 30 characters and level 40 characters is completely different, right? So level 40 will see Douglas and Hardy today, but level 30 will see ARs. Now you might beg the question, well, Luke, how are you seeing level 30 loot, target loot on your level 40 character? Well, this is where the secret comes in. And it's something so simple and yet so subtle that people don't realize and I haven't seen any YouTube videos about this ever. Maybe some people know, but I guarantee you the vast majority of people do not know that you can do this. Find a friend who has a level 30 character or you create a level 30 character yourself, okay? It's so simple. Just delete one of your level 40s. You can boost it up. You don't have to do all the missions, right? You can go into the, the, um, 
the boost character in the store, right? It'll be so simple. What you do is, if you have a level 30 character, go on that level 30 character, look at what the target of loot is today, for example. If you see something that you want to farm that is not available for that day on level 40, invite somebody into your level 30 session. So invite a friend. Once your uh, your friend is in the session, go into the dark zone that you want to farm. Okay. Once he loads in, make sure he's level forty. Once he's loaded in and he's level forty, he will see your targeted loot. So that level forty friend will be able to now farm DZ forty uh, on your targeted loot. But here's the next step. Step two is once he's in there on your session, make him the leader right make the level 40 friend of the leader and then log out of your level 30 character when you log out of your level 30 character your friend is going to keep that session log back in with your level 40 character and join on your friend what will happen is both of you will be in level 40 servers so you will still see the same players that you normally see in level 40 servers. The same people that you fight all day long, right? Wherever you are, you're still going to see those players. You'll be in level 40 servers with level 40 gear. However, the game will keep the targeted loot as level 30. Until you either leave the session. So for example, whoever the leader is, that person is holding the session of that targeted loot. If you leave their session your target of loot is automatically going to flip to level 40. Okay, so as long as the leader stays in that session, it doesn't resume their current... Like, for example, you see how you have this option, leave current session? When you leave um, somebody's game, <coughs> you don't want to do that as the leader. You just want to stay in the session. And what will happen is you will keep the targeted loot for level 30 as a level 40 character. You can bring in four people if you want into the server, right? And and what happens is everybody else right now, okay? If I go into this DZ, everybody else on level 40 is targeting um, Douglas and Harding, okay? So when people are farming these landmarks, they're going to get Douglas and Harding. What they don't know is that you're going to get ARs. You're going to get level 40 ARs. Because that's what's targeted for you right now. Level 40 ARs. Okay? So people don't know that I, I'll i be in the DZ secretly farming other targeted loot that other people don't see. Because they think I'm in Douglas and Harding. And just to prove it to you, I invited a friend today. And I did the process. I made him the leader. And then I logged out and went back with my level 40 character and we were farming ARs. And I, today is the perfect day because if you're looking for an AR or Eagle Bearer, right, level 30 has ARs in the West today. And you can farm with your level 40 character doing this method. Let it be known, I'm posting this video as the first. I've never seen another video. But at the end of the day, if the developers patch it, fine. Patch it, do whatever. But until then, use this to your benefit if you're looking for targeted loot. Okay? And by the way, if you go to the White House, it does not kick you out of the targeted loot because I'm still in the session. Okay? I'm still in this session. I haven't left this actual session. So just by going to the White House does not change my targeted loot because I've already locked into the session. Okay, so some people think if you go to the White House, right, and you stand here forever, let's say for 10 minutes, the targeted loot will flip you. No, you're still going to have level 30 targeted loot. The only way that it can change is if you log out of the game and log back in, or you're not the leader of the session, whoever created it, and you leave that session, then automatically your targeted loot will, will flip to, to whatever the targeted loot is for 40. Or if you accept an invite by another friend who is not, right, in level 30 session, they're in their own level 40 session. If you join somebody else, it will change and flip you back to the level 40. So when you're doing this, you don't want to join random people. You want to stay in your own group, okay? Either you're the leader or the leader has the session. And that's pretty much it. So...
I'm going to say this is my one and only time where I'm going to post something where it might just get patched and it doesn't help me, right? But at the end of the day, the community can do with it what it what it will, right? You could do this today, right now, farm ARs, until they, maybe they don't care. Maybe they won't patch it. Maybe it's, that's the way it's supposed to be. Who knows? I doubt that that's the way it's supposed to be because basically you have six different targeted loots, not three that you can farm every day. And I do have a level 30 character, so this is how I know what the targeted loot is every day. Because all I do is log into my level 30 character here, this, this guy. And I check to see what the targeted loot is for the day. And if I feel like I want to farm or help somebody farm that targeted loot, I'll just create a session and then invite them, make them leader, and then rejoin as my level 40 character. So you see here? This is level 30. Oh, it's loading. This is level 30. World tier 5, 450. This is level 30 ARs, Sokolov, and Negotiator. Now, because I logged off the game, when I log back into my level 40, it's going to throw me back into the original level 40 servers with the targeted loot. It's really the same servers. You're just tricking the game to, to change the targeted loot. That's really what it is. You're not changing servers or anything like that. It's, it's level 40 servers. So now when I load back into my 40, it should probably throw me back into the regular targeted loot for the for today, May 5th. Na, 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 na. In my level 40, now let's see the target of it. See? Douglas Harding, Asberg, and Pistol. Peace out. Good luck. Have fun. Master out. I got a shot on the ball. 